Well, grab your dancing shoes and get ready to enjoy a special performance at the Krenert Center for Performing Arts. It's presented by Department of Dance at the University of Illinois, and Professor Sarah Hook is joining us now with more. So, I'm going to guess some people are not even aware that the University of Illinois has such a world-class department of dance. That's so fun. It is very fun. We're very proud of it. Very excited to share this show. It features some of our new faculty, one of whom is a very famous um, hip-hop artist, Saruj Abrahamian, who will be doing a solo at the very beginning of the show. And I have a piece in Ooh. the concert. And another uh, faculty member, Roxanne de Orleans Juist, who's a famous ex-principal dancer with the Limon Company, is also uh, choreographing a group work. We have a Korean graduate student who is doing a um, solo on a, another graduate student who's from Puerto Rico. It's a very international show. Yeah. And um, it's very dramatic. It features live music by School of Music uh, student, a cellist. And then it, we close the show with another new faculty member's uh, group work made for our first year students that features very lively music. It's very much party atmosphere. He is a ballet folklorico specialist, Mexican American. Um, so it's got a, a, that kind of flavor to it. Yeah, what do you hope people that come to the show take away from it and learn about the dance department at U of I? Well, I really hope that they um, see the diversity of our program, both the aesthetic diversity and the actual people being diverse, which we're very proud of. Yeah. So many international flavors, like yes. you mentioned. Yes. Now, I'm trying to figure this out here. Is this like, you've mentioned faculty members, you've mentioned students, is this kind of like a recital, like, okay, so we've been together already for a couple months here with the school year, and now we're putting together this show, or is this some things we've brought in, we're doing just special extra for the department. It's a little bit of both. Um, cool. Two of the pieces began their creative process last spring in a course called Choreo Process. And all of the other pieces are brand new from the beginning. Um, and that's what another thing that we are known for at the uh, Department of Dance is um, contemporary work. All of these are premieres. Um, even if some started back in the spring, this is the first time they're being performed. So we're very proud of that. We also have shows coming up in January and in March. The March one will be actually in our own Virginia Theater downtown rather than the Cranach Center. Um, so that's new for us and we're excited about that as well. And it's also featuring a very, very diverse lineup. Okay. so. Who should come to this? Can mm -hmm. this be just anyone in the community of all ages, or do you have to be come, kind of someone who's well-versed in the dance world to be able to appreciate what you're going to see? I think you can be anybody and find something in this show to really relate to. Some things you're going to maybe like more than others or feel a sense of familiarity with. Um, but we also have program notes, and um, it's a very welcoming atmosphere, and I think Almost anybody is going to have a great time and find something to really, you know, ask questions about and want to understand more. I want to hear more about your dance. Okay. <laughs> Tell yes. me about it. Well, um, one feature of it that I'm proud of is um, it is featuring a um, new score that will be performed live. And the composer's name is Ralph Lewis, who is an alumnus of the School of Music. It will be played live by a percussionist who is also um, a student currently in the School of Music. Um, it's called Dick and Janes, which comes from that old iconic reader series. Maybe I'm too familiar. old for you guys. <laughs> not, not for me there, not for me. Okay, well, I certainly learned from it. Um, and I'm kind of, through this piece, trying to give a glimpse of what it's like to study dance. And um, Dick and Jane's is sort of uh, a nod to a nostalgia and a kind of studio space that um, many of us in the department can relate to having coming come up through. Yes, okay. Right. Well, this is all coming up October 13th, 14th, and 15th. That's right. 7.30. Tickets are on sale now. We'll have a link on how you can purchase them over at CA Living. TV. It's going to be a great time. Yes. yes. Best Please of luck. Come.
All right, mm -hmm. if um, you would like to learn more, again, we'll have that over on our website. There's a look at theirs right there. And we want to thank Stephanie Pratt's team, your Rockstar Realtors, Coldwell Banker Real Estate Group, for sponsoring today's segment.